Okay guys, this is a viewer request for some gameplay from different ROMs that I've added to the Pandora's Box Arcade Edition. So we're just going to run through a few of these games, show you how they play, show you how they sound, and um, share that with the community. So here we go, let's go into Gradius 3. Okay, seems to sound pretty good. Looks like it's running at a reasonable speed. Let's coin it up. I've had to play with the exposure settings on the camera here just to get this to film reasonably without too much reflection on the screen, so hopefully it's looking pretty good. So Gradius 3 is the only Final Burn Alpha ROM that I've added. Um, if memory serves correctly, all the rest are main. But yeah, I think it seems like it's a, it's a win. It's playing well. Like I said, sounds good. Doesn't seem to be any slowdown. Okay, you want to back out of here and we'll try another game? Alright, Crystal Castles. Let's give that a whirl. So um, anyone who's played Crystal Castles uh, knows that that's played with a trackball. My cabinet doesn't have a trackball, um, just standard joystick setup. But I really do like this game and frankly I'll play it with a joystick anyhow. It's, it's just, it's unique and it's a lot of fun. And um, yeah, as you can see, it runs well. You can hear the, the sound effects. Those are the right sound effects. level one. I'm just going to get a little bit closer to give you a sense of how this is looking. Oops. Yeah, so there you have it. Crystal Castles seems to work well. Do you want to back out and we'll try something else? What else do we have on the list here? Um, do, 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 do. I think we showed Dragon Spirit before. We showed Paperboy before. How about Cubert? Okay, so Cubert is a vertical oriented game. here just so you can see what's going on um, plays well sound wise I feel like it might be missing some sound effects usually Qbert makes some noises when um, he runs into something that, that go along with the little bubble full of swear words so But it looks like it plays at the appropriate speed and seems to play reasonably well. And yeah, some of the sound effects are there, some of the music is there, but I, I do feel like it's maybe missing some. And obviously this is not the easiest game to play if you've never played Cuber. It takes a little bit to get used to uh, how the joystick uh, directions map to the actual game. But yeah, there you have it, Cubert, running on the Pandora's Box 6. Just want to back out and we'll try something else. What else do we have here? Uh, Rampage? Sure, let's, let's give Rampage a go. So this one, uh, once you coin it up, I think you need to use player one fire to start it. Jump button, okay. Okay, that's the right music. Yeah, 
sound effects are working. Speed seems to be right. There's really no music in this game except for the intro. Um, so you just kind of have the ambient sound effects if memory serves when you're playing the game. But yeah, seems seems to be working well. And you can tell this is a three-player version. You've got the three options um, up at the top. I know some of these games that were multiplayer games like Gauntlet and uh, Rampage and certainly games like Turtles in Time and Simpsons and whatnot, they did sometimes make two-player versions of those games that you could run on a, a two-player uh, cab, but, um, you know, I have a three-player you know, player game in this two-player cab, no big deal, still plays. Okay, so let's back out of this and we'll maybe do one or two more games and uh, then we'll we'll call it quits. Uh, what do we have? Altered Beast, we showed Splatterhouse before. How about, um, yeah, put in Alter Beast. Give that a shot. Now, Alter Beast has um, some sound that can be a little bit difficult to emulate sometimes and sounds pretty scratchy. Rise from your grave. It sounds about right to me, I would say. Ooh. Okay, well. <laughs> Doesn't look right anymore, um, so don't know if that's an issue with this particular ROM um, or this game in general. You want to try again and we'll see whether it gets past that. We didn't restart there or anything, it just restarted on its own. Um, I suspect that might be an issue just with the ROM itself. Yeah, so there's definitely an issue with, with either the ROM or the way it's being played, so you can back out of here. Oh, looks like it's a fatal issue. Um, just maybe wait for the video to come back. Well, <laughs> I think that's... Okay, now try backing out. Okay, we'll do one, one last game. We'll try to end on a high note. How about um, Mad Planets? coin up and away we go one last game and um, see how this one plays I really like the sound in that planet it's got a really great music score and there's lots of bass in it and uh, it's it's a fun game so a little bit tricky to play on a cabinet like this again where you only have joysticks and buttons, so you're using the buttons to rotate, which is not really how you're supposed to play this game, but yeah, you can play it. Um, not the easiest, but... So to me, this looks like it's playing well. It's playing fast. Um, speed seems to be appropriate. Sound effects are there. Audio seems to be working. Yeah. So... Uh, with that, we're going to go with a little bit more gameplay here. Appreciate everyone tuning in and watching, and let us know in the comments what you'd like to see more of, and what questions you have, and we'll do our best to try to answer them. And we'll see you next time. Thanks.